Hi, my spirit chasing fans. It's me, your favorite spirit chaser. Um, I wanted to do a quick update on a blog, uh, a blog for you of uh, what has gone on since my 3 a.m. challenge this morning. Um, it's about almost 5.30, 6 o'clock here. As you know, I'm in New York, so we run on Eastern time. Um, just so you know, I feel like crap. I have had a headache since I ended my video last night. Um, I've taken medicine. I've laid down. I'm just sick. Like, my head hurts really bad. I'm very nauseous. Um, but besides me being nauseous, um, since I videotaped, um, last night I got a burning sensation again in my arm. It only lasted for a quick couple seconds, and it was over. Um... I was watching YouTube to go to sleep, and I don't know if you know who Mo Sarji is, but he is also a paranormal investigator, and he has a, a demon or an evil spirit named Tom that follows him around, that he conjured up himself. Well, I made the comment, Mo's got Tom, I got Bob, and as I said that, I got a burning sensation in my arm. I said... Caitlin, please stop and go back to your vessel, and it eased away. I can't explain the pain, but it's like burning from the inside out, but cold on the top. It's very strange. Um, this morning, my daughter told me that she was pushed into the kitchen sink and held there. Um, she then came upstairs to talk to me, and as soon as she came up my stairs, she got an overwhelming sensation. She got real dizzy. She felt like she was being pushed back out. Apparently, Caitlin doesn't like my daughter very much. Well, I went and I rosemaried the house just in case it is an evil person because I feel that Bob may be evil. I feel he has evil tendencies. Um, a lot of strange things have started since I talked to Caitlin last night, but... We're, we're going to see how it goes. I'm going to go back to bed because I just, I, I feel terrible. I'm going to get this vlog up as soon as possible. But we're okay. We're here. Um, Caitlin doesn't mess with anybody else in the house, including my two-year-old granddaughter. Just me and my two-year-old granddaughter's mother, which is my daughter. That's it. Just us. Um, but we are true believers where everybody else is still a skeptic. So, that could be why. I'm not sure. Me and her are very close. Um, we look almost identical. There, there's a lot of reasons why these spirits could have picked her. Or, I don't know. It's just me and her. But I will keep you updated. Um, I'm not going to do a communication tonight with any of my spirit dolls. Um, I'm going to try to rest and get better. And I will update you probably after this weekend. Probably around Monday or Tuesday. So until then, spirit chasing fans, keep chasing those spirits. Keep your head up. And we'll get through anything. Have a good night.